Revelia. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository, whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. Lumos. Lumos. I agree. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right. And I'll be most keen to help him achieve his goals in that regard. Wait. For what? 
Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lodgok said... Oh, your goblin friend? Stop it, that's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing, to find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lodgok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me, or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Rebellion. Agreed. So far, so good. Charming. We must remain unseen. Spiders! How fitting.
Ravenia. and that chest might have fallen. Oh, I think three nudges at least. Revelio. These spiders are determined to make a meal of us. I'm sure we take that in the Anyone's been here for ages. Look at this place. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me.
We've seen rune symbols like these before. Revelio. Confringo! Is finding these chests luck or instinct? Revelio! Quick enough. Revelio.
Troll to bring friends together. Revelio. Revelio. 
Journal entry. Isadora was here. Regarding Leviosa. Leviosa. Revelio. breath after all of those stairs, but the view, well worth it. Another barrier. We can blast through it, I'm certain. Can bring them. Revelio. Good news? This journal entry sounds worrisome. <laughs> Must be another floor above us. Uh, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. <laughs> this place can't have belonged to only Isadora. Another rune symbol. I feel as if I should be fluent in runic language by now. Revelio. Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here.
Bevelia. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. The final canvas piece of the triptych! We've done it! Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Perhaps completing Rebellion. the cryptic will shed more light on all of this. I cannot believe the journey this triptych took us on. This is it. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. Bring my brother back, Father. But I can give you peace. Please, have a seat. Isadora, <laughs> we are all most intrigued to hear... We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. What have you done? I took his pain. Thank you. It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. I would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this? Unnerves them. Not everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. But someone will be. She took away the pain. 
I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felcroft, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes, yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain... It's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care. If at all... If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then for Anne. Why did the Keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? and cleverness. I confronted Piers about it and he confessed straight away, the old rascal. <laughs> We've agreed to let bygones be bygones. Uh, don't forget to say hello the next time you're in the Three Broomsticks. Thrilled to be back there again. I found one of Randrock's drills in a mine along the shore. I intend to destroy it. I'm tired of trying to reason with him. You're welcome to join me, but if I don't see you there, I will reach out when I return. I have something to give you. Nodcock's getting himself into more danger than he realizes. I'd better find him. Sir, are you all right? You seem to be in some distress. All right? Do I look all right? I've been kidnapped! How can you be kidnapped when you're right here? What sort of question is that? Of course I'm right here. I've more than one frame. Do you only have one home? It's my other frame. It's been stolen. And by students, no less. They paid filthy fees to steal my other frame. Oh dear, that sounds awful. Well, awful is exactly what Astoria Cricket is. She's behind all of this. She and her friends were moaning about me of all the nerve. Then I heard a plot to enlist a gang of good-for-nothings to have me stolen from the three broomsticks. That's why my other frame hung. Marvel of a place. Though I suppose one could do worse. I once knew a portrait who ended up in the hog's head. No one's heard from him since. Right. So, back to your frame. Ah, yes. There I was, powdering my wig, and the next thing I knew, I was being manhandled by rogues and carried off. As if I can afford not to be at my post. I do important work for the headmaster, and I need my other frame back at the three broomsticks. Ah. 
I don't suppose you have any idea where your stolen frame was taken. Can you see anything from it? I most certainly can. They brought me to a ruin of all places. Some crumbling atrocity surrounded by water from the sound of it. Oh, I do also recall seeing the coast on the way. I could look into the matter for you. Oh, would you? How marvellous. Do it quickly, though, won't you? The place they took me to is quite beneath me. Off you go, then. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. It is wonderful to see you back here. Oh, perhaps today you have something you'd like Penny to sell for you? Astoria Cricket? That depends. Am I in trouble? Ferdinand Pratt thinks you should be. Says you stole his frame. I wouldn't call it stolen. Relocated's more like it. How do I put this nicely? Ferdinand Pratt is a postulant boil, and he's lucky I didn't have him sealed in a wall. Surely he can't be that terrible. Can he? All he does is spy on students in here and report back to the headmaster. Sometimes, if there's nothing to report, he'll make it up. I spent four hours in detention last week, all because he told Black that I was planning to drain the lake, whatever that means. It was the last straw. He and his frame had to go. May I ask where you put him? Well, I didn't put him anywhere. The frame is likely with the fine gents I paid to snatch it. They camp in a ruin by the coast. I just wanted it far enough away that I'd never have to think about Ferdinand Pratt ever again. You do know he's screaming in the library as we speak. Oh, for the love of Merlin. If you ask me, he's got nothing to scream about. I could have had him put in the hog's head. The pampered Pratt would have hated it. Grimy walls, smell of goats. And the patrons, they eat snooty princes like Ferdinand for dinner. But what's done is done. He isn't here anymore, and if I were you, I should enjoy it. Lovely chatting with you.
Revelio. Rebellion. 